must know hacks to look stylish and feel more confident. Hi everyone, welcome back. Whether it's figuring out how to stop a hem from raveling or to expand your clothes without having to buy more stuff, the hacks I'm about to share will not only make dressing easier, but you have you wearing your clothes more often. If I have to be honest, the hacks I've seen online can come off as looking simple, but actually they can make things more complicated. So the list I'm about to share consists of try and true hacks that I've tried myself whenever I found myself in a clothing mishap. So if this is something you're interested in, then keep on watching. Tuck your shirt or sweater into your bra for the perfect crop. Tucking in your top into your skirts or pants can often look sloppy and bulky. But tucking in the top into your bra can make the perfect cropped length. Just try it for yourself. Using a safety pin to adjust your blazer. Keeping your style fresh is time-consuming and expensive task. But doing so doesn't necessarily involve buying more stuff. That's where pins, patches, elastic bands come in handy. They are the ultimate way to customize everything without you having to buy more stuff. And the best thing, they can be easily removed. Wear your shirt in a different way. Sometimes wearing your favorite shirt the same way can feel boring. And instead of leaving it at the back of your wardrobe, try and style it in new ways. There's not a single way to wear an item. That's all conventions. You can wear the piece the way you want. You can wear your shirt as a skirt. Why not? I show that in other videos. It's all about freedom of choice. I remember my days in fashion when we used items in different ways, perhaps a dress as a shirt or a sweater as a skirt or even a skirt on top of pants. All these things, they are way more admissible in a fashion world, but there's nothing preventing us from translating into our daily lives. There are rules in this channel. So it's open for those who are open-minded and creative. Don't have a cardigan or blazer for your dress? Tie a simple knot at the end of your button down or pull the ends around and tie it at the back. So when you're feeling that your shirt is old school, try it wearing it backwards, for example. When simply tucking in a shirt looks sloppy, try crisscrossing it for a more tidy result. The options are endless. How to tie a pussy bow blouse. Pussy bow blouse, as you can see, are having a comeback and I'm loving it. Because I love pussy bows, I think they are timeless and elegant. But I think there are other ways to style it that adds interest. One of my favorite ways to tie a ball is to make it a men's inspired tie, like so. It looks perfect when you pair it with feminine pieces. The ultimate cool way to do is, is to make a flower effect, and it's also very simple to do. Simply fold the straps and tie it with an elastic band. And voila! I also like it simply pinned with a brooch. Use fashion tape for. There are infinite ways to wear a fashion tape. It was actually created in Hollywood by stylists. If you machine wash your shirts, you likely see your fair share of colors that even a hot iron can tame. Likewise, if you've got a necklace that you'd like to keep visible beneath your silk blouse or a stiff color that's crowding your face, fashion tape can help. Just apply small pieces of the tape to the undersides of the color points. Determine how much of a Y-shaped neckline you want to create. Then tape the color to the shirt. You're about to head out and notice your hem begins to unravel. 
Fashion tapes makes a fix that holds better and looks better than safety pins. You can make it through the day with confidence and get out of your needle and thread once you get home. Tie a trench coat like a pro. Instead of giving it the boring double knot or just leaving it hanging there, try something different. Put the size of the belt without the buckle a bit longer and cross over the side with the buckle. Draw the long strap under and up to cinch. Let it hang. Loop the strap some buckle under the other and pull horizontally. Pull the strap without the buckle away from the body and through the loop. Shorten and shape your pants with an elastic band. This is for all of you who think you can pull off a baggy jeans, which is so in at the moment. You try pair after pair, but something doesn't just quite feel right. They're simply too baggy and relaxed for you. So here was the trick comes in. While you're wearing the jeans, rather than letting the hem drag everything around, tie them with an elastic band as you would a ponytail to make them tighter around the ankle. While holding the ponytail in place, secure it with a safety pin and pin it from the inside so your fix is invisible. Voila! You now have tapered boyfriend jeans that are nice and skinny around the ankle. Safety pins are your best friends. I use safety pins for just about everything. Tightening my pants around my waist, to adjusting the bra strap, you can adjust and create silhouettes in your blazers and shirts. Or if you want to have the off-shoulder top look, pin one bra strap to your shirt. Use a ribbon as a quick loose jeans fix. We all have those items that we keep saying to ourselves you have to take to a tailor, but never end up making it there. I found a cute way to fix that. When I'm in a pinch, I tie a ribbon or short scarf to the front two loops of jeans and, and tie it to tighten the waist. Remember these styling hacks are meant to inspire and guide you to create more creatively, more, more free of conventions and having your wearing your clothes without fear, whatever it might be. The key here is to have fun, experiment, express your creativity, exercise your creativity, and embrace your own unique fashion journey. So there you have it, everyone. These quick hacks that I myself find myself using all the time. I hope you found this informative. And if you did, please go ahead and give this video a like and consider subscribing to this channel if you haven't already done so. Thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate your time. As usual, have a great day, everyone. And I'll see you in my next video. Take care. Bye.